Jay, were you pleased with that performance? Large parts of it, yes. Obviously, um, Julian brought down a, a young side, which um, which it would have been nice to have a few other ones, but you, they're, a, they're a side with lads that will go on and have good careers in the Football League. So um, I think for us, I was really on about the tempo and making sure we did things right. And I thought, especially first half, the tempo, we started really, really well. And um, and I thought for the large parts of it, we, we were very good. And more minutes in the tank, obviously, for the whole team. And the new boys also getting up to speed. Are you happy with how they settled in? Really pleased. Um, obviously, we've we've got a few knocks and niggles here and there, and Gio's had to limit his minutes, um, but he's getting there now. Um, I thought Cody has, has slotted in really well. I thought you could see that today. Uh, Joel Powell and Higo, sort of in that mid midfield role, is something that I said that we the reason we signed him is because I felt we lacked someone like him last season. So, but um, yeah, the, all, all the new lads I think have come in and done well and added to us. Um, and, and, and that's good. Um, you don't read too much in the pre-season. I won't read loads into tonight. All I said to the lads was, could we really press at a high tempo? Could we be really positive in our play? And it was good for tonight to look at sort of our attacking patterns, if you like. And I felt that some of the moves and uh, some of the combinations were, were very good first off. It looked a slightly different shape. Were you sort of experimenting? Yeah, yeah. I just felt it was an opportunity to look at something. Obviously, with a back three, it's something that we, we roll into at times during the season. Um, it enables to get the two up front. I thought Faggy and Ruben were a real handful for them. Um, and at the back, we look solid. So, um, yeah, it's, it's nice to have those options. And even Waggy playing at, at right wing back, you could see the quality he adds out there. So it, it shows you where the strength of the squad is if you think really sort of the ones we've got missing, Joe Turner still away, Ben Swift away, Bochy not away, um, Janaid, who, who had a previous engagement, hence why he weren't here. So... You're looking at it again, we've got, some, we've got a strong squad and it's good to still be able to put out a side that um, is competitive. And Tommy Wood left the club this week. Does that make Tommy Fagg first choice, especially if Stefan's sort of got a bit of a knock? <laughs> no, it's... Um, Faggy's played there for me before and he's played there when he was younger. To be honest, tonight it was a case we didn't have Bochy, we didn't have Stefan because he's picked up this knock on his foot. Um, so with a two out front, I just wanted to look at it. He's someone that can do that role and I'm quite confident in that. So we... Um, we played him there, but I wouldn't say his first choice forward. Um, he's done really well, but he, he does really well when he plays midfield. He's, he's a good player, so um, it was just something we looked at. I think when I sort of heard that Julian were coming with quite a young team, I felt an opportunity then to change our shape. We haven't done loads of work on it, so it was an opportunity to change our shape and, and to play people like Waggy out wide and, and Faggy down there were up there with Ruben more central than, than wide. So it was an opportunity to look at things, and, and that's it's a positive when it comes off. Um, so yeah, it was good. And heading up north on Friday, uh, playing Scarborough on Saturday, what kind of what good can that trip do for the squad? A, a lot of good. Um, I mean, one one way to look at it is people go out for team bonding, which which you you obviously is good for the lads. Secondly, as I just said, there in the changing room, we've got a, we probably have a couple of overnight stays this year and uh, going to Torquay and places like that. And we've got players that probably haven't done that throughout their career, and it is different. Play, uh, I think supporters might look at it and go, "Oh, that's all right. They get to go out on Friday have an overnight." It doesn't work like that. It changes everything. You. Footballers are very um, superstitious and like doing things on a match day a certain way. So it's getting them used to something different. Um, the club's been fantastic with it. I've got to thank the board and, uh, and other people. I know behind the scenes, sponsors and that have put some money in to allow us to do it. Um, so we're travelling up on the Friday, training at York on the way up there so we can put some stuff into the boys for the Saturday game. It'll be a really good test against Scarborough, a good side, Jonathan Green up there. It'll be... Uh, be a good test for us, uh, sort of level equivalent to what we play at. So um, really looking forward to it. And uh, yeah, the boys will will get to have a night out and, and spend some time together. So um, they're looking forward to it. But as I say, we've got to thank the board. They've been uh, fantastic in allowing us to do it. And that'll be the penultimate game of pre-season, just Margate left after that. Are you feeling ready for the season now? Yeah, yeah, it does feel like we've had a break, does it? It's, it's gone so quick. Um, it's, there's been lots of positives, um, but... It's pre-season, so the, the the thing I'm more concerned about is making sure we don't pick up too many knocks. Um, there's been, we've looked good in patches. Have I had my full starting eleven out? I'd probably say no. Um, not been able to do that yet. So it's something that going into the last couple of games, we'll we'll now nail things down. Um, you probably won't see as many changes during the game unless we really need to, or if I don't think people are doing well enough, I'll take them off and start. I think for these last two games, really run the games like a, like as if it was first game of the season. Perfect. All right, look forward to it. Lovely, thank you.